Hi everyone and welcome back to Top Grade. My name is Spencer Miller and today I'll be sharing with you a selection of brand new picture books from Canadian publishers for the winter 2023-2024 season. I love talking about picture books, so let's get started. We Need Everyone is published by Highwater Press, written by Michael Redhead Champagne, and illustrated by Tiff Bartell. This inclusive and inspiring picture book empowers young readers to identify their unique gifts and use them to overcome challenges and strengthen their communities. This book is based off of an exercise that the author conducts while speaking with youth across the country. Reading this book out loud with your students is like inviting a powerful guest speaker into your classroom. After reading together, give your students time to try out the three simple steps to finding, identifying, and using their special gift. Pirate Glitterbeard is published by Rebel Mountain Press and created by the mother-daughter duo of Oksana and Larissa Crawley. Pirate Glitterbeard is a fun, funny, colorful, sparkle-filled celebration of being your true, authentic self. The story gently plays with gender norms and expectations as it takes a fearsome group of pirates and puts them in a situation where they can let their guard down and just be themselves. It turns out that the pirates love to bake and dance and craft and sing and they're all happier when they are just celebrating their own interests and each other. This book is ideal for classroom read-alouds with its humor, its funny wordplay, and its enticing illustrations. Get ready for a lot of giggles in your classroom. All the Faces of Me is published by Owl Kids Press. It's written by Laura Aleri and illustrated by Celini Pereira. This is a playful yet profound story that teaches young readers about identifying and expressing emotions. In the story, a little girl decides to draw faces, showing how she's feeling on each of her grandmother's wooden nesting dolls. At first, Nana is angry, but after talking together, she comes to understand all of the things that her granddaughter is feeling. This story shares the important lesson that sometimes the people around us are feeling more than we can see. After reading, give your students time to draw or paint a series of self-portraits. Let them express how they look when they feel happy or sad or tired or annoyed or any number of emotions. Also from Owl Kids Books is Aaliyah's Secret, a story of Ramadan, written and illustrated by Farida Zaman. Aaliyah's Secret is a heartwarming celebration of Ramadan, food, and community. Ramadan is coming, and young Aaliyah secretly decides to join in on her parents' month-long fast. At first, Aaliyah is disappointed when she's unable to make it through an entire day without eating, but soon she's cheered up when she learns that there are other ways to celebrate Ramadan besides fasting, such as performing acts of kindness. This joyful look at Ramadan is inspired by the author's own childhood experiences. It's rich with facts and details about the holiday, perfect for readers who are familiar and unfamiliar with the celebration. Khadija and the Elephant Toothpaste Experiment is published by Second Story Press. It's written by Farah Kaiser and Hajar Nakua and illustrated by Natalia Tarek. Written by a pair of real-life scientists, this story carries the message that science is for everyone. In the story, a young girl named Khadija is inspired after visiting the local science fair, but she notices that none of the scientists are wearing a hijab like she does. When she gets home, she decides to recreate some of their experiments to mixed and messy results. The important representation in this book draws attention to the experiences of women of color in STEM and encourages all young girls to pursue science and exploration. Blue Camus, Blue Camus is published by Heritage House, written by Danielle S. Marcotte, and illustrated by Alyssa Kosky. This is the captivating story of how the Blue Camus flower came to symbolize the meeting of two contrasting ways of life and the perseverance of traditional knowledge against all odds. It's an ode to a way of life that was threatened and nearly destroyed through miscommunication and colonization. The book raises awareness for food rights, biodiversity, and the preservation of ecosystems. It gives teachers and students a way to openly and constructively discuss the harmful effects of colonization on the land that we live on. Up Home is now available in a new 15th anniversary edition from Nimbus Publishing. This beloved story is written by Shante Grant and illustrated by Susan Took. Up Home celebrates North Preston, Nova Scotia, one of Canada's most important historically black communities. 
Author Shante Grant shares poetic childhood memories. Her words bring life to the sights, sounds, rhythms, and people of a joyful place. This book teaches students that the communities we live in have deep roots and important histories. It's a wonderful way to teach Black history in Canada to young learners. Our final book for today perfectly fits a winter theme. Xander Stays from Pajama Press is written by Maureen Fergus and illustrated by Scott Ritchie. This humorous winter-themed book is a fun way to talk about trying new things and failing along the way. It also teaches young readers about animal adaptations, hibernations, and migrations. In the story, Xander the Goose decides to try something new. He's staying put for the winter. But braving the cold isn't easy. With the help of some animal friends, Xander tries out different ways of adapting to the cold, some more successful than others. Xander the Goose is such a fun character and really relatable for young readers. After you finish reading together, give your students the chance to share a story about their own experiences trying something new and encourage them to view failure as part of the learning process. And those are all of our books for today. On behalf of the Association of Canadian Publishers, thank you for watching. We really appreciate all of your support. Make sure to like the video, um, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any new Canadian book content. We also want to give a big thank you to Ontario Creates for their continued support of the Top Grade program.